This video will show you how to download user information from a clock and insert that information into a tenant's manager. There's a great benefit to adding and managing your employee data from a tenant's manager rather than physically on the clock itself. It's much easier and faster and with the exception of adding facial recognition or fingerprints, you can do it all right from your computer. This is most often done after all employees' fingerprints and facial scans have been entered physically on the clock. Once you download this information, it can then be uploaded to other clocks allowing you to enter facial scans and fingerprints only once. To download data from the clock to attendance tenant's management, you'll need to make sure that you're connected to the clock first. As you can see in this example, I am currently disconnected. If this is the first time that you have ever connected to this clock before, you're going to want to click on the clock and then click on device. In this screen, you can add an additional device if needed. To do this, click on the Add button, name the clock, and then select Ethernet. It will then allow you to enter the IP address for that clock. I'm going to delete this clock by clicking the Delete button. Again, make sure that the IP address on this screen for whatever device you want to download from matches the IP address on the clock. Then click Save. Please note that if you're not sure where to find the IP address, please refer to the clock documents on how to find that. You may now close out of the screen. Now, select the device that you want to connect to and click Connect at the top toolbar. Sometimes it may take more than one attempt for a clock to connect. But as you can see, the clock is now connected as indicated in the lower right hand corner of the screen. You can also ver verify this by the orange and green arrows next to the device name. Now it's time to download the data from the clock. First, click on User Info and FP on the left hand side of the screen, identified by the blue arrow next to it. Click on the device you want to download from. Note that if you're downloading fingerprints or facial recognition data, make sure to select those corresponding checkboxes over on the bottom left hand corner of this window before clicking download. Then click on the large download button. You will begin to see your employees populate on the screen. After this has completed, the process is complete. Please note that even after you have downloaded this information from an existing clock, you can add employees to the clock right from Attendance Manager. So in the case that you hire a new employee and you would like to have their information added into Dominion Systems in the Employee tab just like you normally would. However, instead of downloading entirely new information to Attendance Manager, you can simply click on the Employee button in the upper right hand corner. First, go to the Employee button. Then click on Our Company, click on the blue Add button, then type in the employee's name, then type in the employee's number from Dominion Systems, then click Save. You can also delete this employee by selecting the employee and clicking Delete. Once you've finished, you may close this window. If you would like to see how to upload information to a clock or import a CSV file of employees into attendance management, please see one of our other videos. Thank you.